me so happy. Look how cute it is. And then I'm also going to eat this mango afterwards. Oh, yes. Alright, put your glove down, Elvis. Sandy, throw me the ball when I tell you, okay? Alright, ready? Elvis, go! Sandy, throw it! Alright, try again, Elvis. Right there. Scotty, go stand over there. No, Okay, go stand. Watch out, Scout. What? Ready, go! Sandy, throw it! Safe! Nice. You don't need a glove, Elvis. Alright, Sandy, go! Elvis, go! <laughs> Safe! Ow. Safe! Alright, Scotty, your turn. Go stand over there. Dad, give me okay, ready, Scout? Ready, go! Mama! Go, Scout, run! Run to mommy! Go do your slides! Do your slides! Throw it, Elvis! Oh. <laughs> Safe! Uh. All right, I am stripping the diapers today and I found a pretty good natural solution to strip diapers without using bleach. And I learned that from my friend Amber. Her YouTube channel is called The Fairly Local Vegan. And I'm just gonna show you what we do. Today, we're just hanging around the house. I'm gonna be stripping the diapers all day. I'm gonna be soaking the diapers in this natural solution and go on with the rest of the day while they're soaking. So first, we're gonna put all the diapers in here. Next, I'm gonna put Let's see, about three cups if I have enough of hydrogen peroxide. Okay, I'm gonna run out. Okay, just enough. And then I'm gonna do two cups of lemon juice. The boys are still playing baseball. It's been like an hour. They would play all day if they could. Oh! The ball stuck in the tree? And then just enough water to fill over the diapers. <sighs> Let's get some more. And I'm just gonna let them soak for a few hours. Come and shake it up again every couple hours and just leave it like this all day. And then I'm gonna hang dry them after I wash them again. In the sun. Bam! Table, lay your water. Let's get back on the couch. Alright guys, we have some exciting news for you. Andrew and I created this campaign with this organization called Charity Water. We are asking that you guys, our wonderful audience, help us raise $10,000 for Charity Water. And in return, we will match up to that amount and also, as a thanks for reaching our goal, we're going to make a video for you guys that has been highly requested. We're going to shave Andrew's mustache on camera. What do you think of that, kids? What the heckins? What do you think? Daddy shaved his mustache? What the heckins? Where's Daddy's mustache? Where's Daddy's mustache? Oh! <laughs> what? Where is it? Yeah, is it gonna go bye-bye? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Andrew hasn't shaved his mustache in 11 years, so our children literally have never seen their dad without a mustache. So I'm a little bit nervous. Uh, a little worried about the tan line that might be hiding underneath there. Oh, I haven't even thought of that. <laughs> we want to do something fun with Andrew shaving his mustache and filming it, so we thought it would be a really good fit to raise money for a great charity while we do it. Charity Water is a nonprofit organization that brings clean and safe drinking water to people in developing countries that don't have access to clean water. We first learned about Charity Water through a Rich Roll podcast where Rich Roll interviewed the founder of Charity Water, Scott Harrison. And we really appreciate the transparency of this charity, so it's been one of our favorite organizations to donate to ever since. Two things that made Charity Water stand out to us was that they track all the funds that you give. Uh, so you know exactly where the money's going. 
Um, they send you photos and GPS coordinates and updates on the water projects that uh, you help fund. They've consistently received the highest grades available for transparency and accountability. Private donors cover all the operating costs, so 100% of all the money that you donate goes directly to water projects. And lastly, they work with local communities and organizations to build the water projects, as they firmly believe that local experts know how to serve their community better than anyone else. Our goal is to sponsor a water project which 100% funds clean water. That's why our goal is to raise $10,000 and we will on top of that match up to $10,000 of what is donated. This way your gift is basically worth double. This amount can cover the cost of a clean water project for a community without clean water. I'll put the link to this campaign where you can donate in the description box below. Any amount you can give is so appreciated and we really hope that we can reach this goal. Or else I'm not shaving my mustache. <laughs> You didn't see it? Look, it's right, it's right there. chips with the yeah. look how good that looks like. so good <laughs> right does that it looks like something you get at a looks restaurant like a magazine cover right now yes. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 
like some jalapenos on the side. This is my second bowl. <laughs> All right, so dinner's over, and now me and Jess snuck downstairs where you can't hear the kids as much. You can still hear the kids. Yeah, well, <laughs> you can still hear the kids. And she's going to show me a little bit about her membership that she has, her and Garrett. They have this awesome membership, and she's going to show me a little bit because I'm thinking about doing a membership myself soon. And yeah, so I want you to show me. So we have a membership program for our followers that are like really ded dedicated and just want more information. Yeah. Like, I don't think we would ever write a book. Yeah. I don't think we'd ever... I don't know. It's just a lot of stuff that is, like, a little bit too deep, too intimate to share on social media. Yes. You know? But I, I do think there's, like, a handful of people, or we found a group of people that, like, really find value in what else we want to share. So we provide a monthly webinar that's on varying topics, like traveling with kids, how to pack, yeah. entrepreneurship, parenting, like, yeah. all of our views. And then we provide a deal to, like... A travel destination or like a travel tool or like luggage or yeah. GoPros so um, I kind of want more yeah. from you you know yeah so she's showing me a little bit if you want to check out their membership it's just bucketlistfamily.com right yep bucketlistfamily.com forward slash friends and then you can sign up and you guys put out such good family friendly content and I just my kids love your videos Aww. so yeah if you want to check them out you can I'll put a link below so you can check out their their website because you guys are amazing. <laughs> like here's all the months we've so done. The, the, this is all the months we've done in the past. Now you can finish your travel. All sorts of different topics. Yeah. So they. So they are. This is the archive. And then do they get this to see what's so coming they get next? To... Yeah. That's it. If I was a bucket list runner, I would just like turn it on and listen to it. Yeah. You know, like you know, a podcast. Yeah. It's like a podcast, but we just record it. I'm probably basis. gonna do like a little bit style like that, but then. Some... And then we have these like I don't know how many people use these, but I think they're super cute. We have this girl with the deal. Yeah. <laughs>